From crewed missions to asteroid defense, 2022 was replete with groundbreaking space milestones that captured the world's attention. On a personal note, I'd like to single out my own top six space-related stories that had me gazing skyward in 2022. Okay. At the top of the list is, of course, the construction of China Space Station. As of the publication of this video, the China Manned Space Agency has not yet officially announced its completion, but it has put three major modules into orbit a core and two labs. That together has formed the iconic T-shaped configuration. China now has its own space station that is open for international collaboration without excluding any single country. Five, four, three, two, one, and liftoff. After four attempts, the experimental Orion spacecraft rode a humongous space launch system rocket and gave us a sneak peek of what Earth looks like from the moon. It splashed down in the Pacific Ocean on December 11, signaled a new chapter in humanity's return to the moon after more than half a century. The mission success also kicked off a new lunar exploration race, which China joined or called for cooperation, to be exact, by executing the fourth phase of a program it initiated in April. With launch missions Chang'e 6, 7, and 8, China aims to explore the south pole of the moon and to commence building the International Lunar Research Station. If we're talking about the moon, we'll also have to talk about Mars. In 2022, the number of operational Mars probes reached 11, since reduced by one with the retirement of America's InSight just a few days ago. China's first ever Mars rover, Zhu Rong, has been exploring the red planet for over a year. As of May 15, it has logged 347 Martian days and captured 940 gigabytes of data. It has now entered hibernation for the duration of the cold and dark Martian winter. The year 2022 was also a launch window to Mars, as the astronomical phenomenon known as Mars Opposition afforded spacecrafts their most fuel-efficient route to the planet. Unfortunately, none launched this year, and the window will not open for another two years. From the moon to the red planet, now let's peer more deeply into our universe. Fourth on my list is the James Webb Space Telescope. Launched on Christmas Day 2021, the JWST has celebrated its first anniversary and will surely continue to transmit astonishing cosmological data. Heads up! From among the mesmerizing stars, an uninvited guest might hurtle toward Earth and potentially deliver a catastrophic surprise. In preventing such a disaster, planetary defense experts want to nudge the threatening asteroids or comets out of harm's way years or even decades before the impact. As such, number five on my list is humanity's attempts to affect the orbit of a celestial body, which the double asteroid redirection test mission achieved for the first time ever. In April, China also announced a planned asteroid defense system that will be tested in 2025 or 2026. It will monitor a risky asteroid and potentially deflected from its Earth-bound trajectory. Come back down to low Earth orbit, where the tens of thousands of satellites and bits of space debris worry me. In 2021, China's space station had to maneuver twice to avoid a collision from SpaceX Starlink satellites. In fact, these satellites are involved in an average of 1,600 close encounters every week, accounting for nearly 50% of such incidents. And once the entire constellation is deployed, that number will jump to 90%. With the rise of commercial space industry and the ever more crowded LEO, orbital clutter poses real threat 
to space exploration. China is therefore active in space environment governance and has proposed several solutions. At Airshow China 2022, I learned that a fist-sized device installed aboard a satellite can be deployed like a kite, helping to accelerate the deorbiting of obsolete spacecrafts. Either that or a satellite fuel supplier could extend their service life. I believe that with the dream of sustainable exploration in mind, we can optimize our shared space through cooperation. That's my wrap up of space news in 2022. What do you think and what tops your list of expectations for 2023? This is Chen Chen, signing off until next year.